Hello and welcome. Today we're going to be looking at how we manage our storage in Google Drive. Now recently there have been restrictions and limits put on place for education accounts for overall storage. This won't impact many people but if you do need to keep on top of your storage this might be helpful. So in Google Drive over on the left hand side you can actually see here the amount of storage I'm using in this account. If I then click on the storage icon, it's going to give me a breakdown of this. So it shows me where I'm using my storage. So in Drive, in Mail and in Photos. Obviously you can see in Drive, this is where the majority of my storage is happening. Below this is what I've got on my files. So this is all my files and what it's done, I can order this in size order. So at the moment, this is my biggest file. And as you can see, this is taking up almost a quarter of my storage. So what I really want to do is go through and check which files I want to delete and which files I want to keep. So you can obviously go through, open up a file and check on this. Some of these I will just know that I don't want. So for example, I've got a file here that was created in December 2018. So I'm not going to do this. What we did find, um, particularly over lockdown where we created a lot of videos, that it is video files that take up the majority of our storage. So you might see some of these in your Google Meet recordings, for example, or Screencastify recordings, things like that, and any other uh, files that your students might have sent to you. One thing to note is that if you see this icon next to a file, that means it's in a shared drive. So actually deleting that file won't have any impact on your personal storage level. So I'm going to go through and delete some of these. So I can just click on a file. If I'm holding down control, I can then click on other files. I can miss some out if I want, but going through, selecting those I don't want. And as you can see, these are all video files I'm going to be removing. Once I've finished selecting the files I want to delete, I can either right click and select move to bin or I can drag and drop them into the bin. If you are selecting a lot of files this can lag a little bit. So I'm going to move to the bin. It's telling me they're going to be deleted forever after 30 days. Now in your bin as it said it's going to keep these for 30 days and after that they will be deleted forever. If you have deleted something by mistake if you click on it you can then right click and restore it or what I can do is delete forever. So I'm actually going to empty my bin because I want these uh, storage savings to take effect right now. So I clicked empty bin, delete forever. So now I've got no more items in my bin. You can see my storage is still at 4.67. I'm going to refresh my page. And you can see I've just saved three gigabytes of storage on this account. So I hope this helps you manage your storage in Google Drive.